Hey guys, so we are on our way to um, ongoing foster care classes and I just wanted to share a little more advice with you about foster care. So something I did today is I emailed our clinician and I asked her if we could go over the checklist that we provided in the beginning and there were some things we didn't understand that we didn't ask questions about and we just kind of filled it out to the best of our knowledge will consider will not consider um we actually had to change some things to even be able to foster that we didn't know about oh there's an accident oh it looks like everybody's okay so yeah um we were just praying for our trip that we'd be safe on the way there and we just pray that everybody else is safe. But it looks like everything's okay. So, yeah. So, one advice, uh, one set of advice I'd give is just to um, ask questions. Like, don't try to figure it out yourself. Just ask questions because they work with these checklists all the time or different things. And they know what's going on. And, um, yeah, so another thing I wanted to share with you is my husband Ross here, and I wanted to ask him, <laughs> hi, and I wanted to ask him what advice he could give you guys as a man um, for fostering, or what some of his thoughts have been. So, what would you say, babe? Well, I was... As my wife already said, obviously ask questions, uh, especially when you, uh, most people, I assume, are new at the fostering process, um, and they are just getting started with it, so yeah, ask questions, and also something we did is we go, the church we go to, there's a, a couple that goes to the same church as we do, and they fostered, I don't remember how many kids, quite a few of them, and we, so we, uh, after service one day, we, we talked to them a little, for a little while, and I got advice from them, and they told us some of the experiences that they had, so, yeah, Spending time with other people that have already, I guess you could say, been there and done that, it's very helpful. So, those uh, would be the big things I would say. Well, at least I can think of right now. <laughs> I'm trying to focus on driving some too, so I can't <laughs> really think of everything. Well, that's good. I think that's wise advice. Wise advice from a wise man. So, I don't know if you guys have noticed our shirts. They say oneness. Mine says, I love my husband, and his says, I love my wife. And we get questions about these shirts all the time. We actually usually wear them not at the same time, like on different days. And we've worn them on the same time or on the same day before. But um, I just thought I would throw in there that we got them from a marriage conference. It's called Family Life. So if you don't know much about it, go ahead and check it out. It's kind of like focus on the family in a way, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and um, so I just wanted to throw that in there. But, yeah, exactly what he said. I'm so glad that he could share with that with you guys because I didn't even think about that. But, yeah, that really helped as well. In fact, I plan to ask a lot more questions to people that we know that are foster parents. Um, I'm going over to someone's house tomorrow that um, she's a foster parent for, I believe, six years. And I just am really excited to spend time with them and, and talk to them. So, yeah, I mean, always learn from others. And, you know, it's an ongoing learning process. Another thing I thought I'd show you, even though it's not the best, the cleanest back here yet, but... That is a convertible car seat that we got off of Amazon for, I believe it was $83 and some change. Um, yeah, that's right. I looked at it now. They're like 101 <laughs> but 
but we got that a few months ago actually <laughs> we plan to be licensed a lot sooner than we were and then oh uh, let's see there's a car seat base and a little mirror back there the mirror we got at a garage sale for super cheap it's like a dollar and uh the car seat base is for the infant car seat that we have which i'll make another video and show you guys um what we got off of amazon for a good deal um and one thing if you're looking for a good deal for things off of amazon they have um where you can buy stuff like if you go down a lot of things you can buy them used um, I don't mind buying things used at all as long as they're not like broken um, or like really bad but like you go to the used part and or the the used or something like that it says and then it'll say a lower price than what it is and then you can click on it and it will say like new um, just packaging is damaged or it'll say like fair or damaged or something so obviously like our stroller they had one that was damaged that was cheaper but I didn't want a damaged stroller they said it still worked but I wanted everything to work so we did get it for about $20 or 15 or $20 cheaper um, by getting the damaged packaging because it's just the packaging like not a big deal as long as the item isn't um damaged so we got we did two things that way and we got them pretty cheap i'm very happy with um them and i will show you guys that later at a later time um but yeah so when you're in foster care you continue having education classes which i'm very thankful for because it, we haven't been to classes since may and now it is October, so we could use an update, you know, and it's just refreshing to keep, even if it's the same things that you hear, which I'm sure it'll be different things, but it's just like, we need to be reminded of those things constantly, you know what I mean? Right, babe? That's right. <laughs> so anyways, we're almost there. We live about a half hour away. Um, we do have... Um, the county that we live in, um, the job and family services is actually almost right across the street from our house, not too far, but um, we like this agency. This is a private agency we go through. It's a Christian agency, and we just were drawn to it, and as we got to know things about it, we just thought it was a really good choice for us. Um, so yeah, and I know people that go through the county, and I know people that go through other agencies, and I have a friend that works for another agency, and so yeah, I mean, it's, it depends on um, your needs, and you can always call around and ask if you have certain specific needs or different questions. Like, feel free to ask. I mean, that's how you find out information. No question is a dumb question. Agreed. <laughs> I just like to put him on camera because he doesn't get to be on camera as much as I go on camera. So, <laughs> and I missed him all day because I he just got home from work before we left. So, I'm thankful for him. <laughs> I'm thankful for her too. Marriage 101. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> all right, guys. Well, have a blessed day, and until next time, we'll see ya. Bye. Bye.